had three activities operating activity investing activity and financial activity had opening cash it should be equal to closing cash closing profit minus opening profit add back depreciation goodwill retail now transfer to reserve provision for taxation proposed dividend loss on sale of asset sale of fixed asset inflow sale of investment inflow purchase of fixed outflow purchase of investment outflow whatever the difference comes it is called net cash flow from investing activity hello my dear student i am dr b s subramanya called by name dr b s s professor in commerce and management vidyashram first aid college a temple of excellence mysore today i am going to hand management accounting 6th semester unit 4 session 1 in favor of cash flow statement how cash comes and how cash goes here that is a flow in cash flow statement there are three activities one is called operating activity another is investing activity number 3 financial activity which are the three activities are number 1 operating activities investing activity and financial activity all the three activities should be added opening cash at bank or cash in hand should be added the answer should be equal to closing i will give the beautiful format according to format you have to work we will move on to the format now this is specimen of cash flow statement income from operating activity difference in profit first you have to take the difference in profit closing profit minus op opening profit the result will come here then add depreciation should be added goodwill return off should be added then transfer to reserve should be added provision for taxation should be added proposed dividend should be added loss on sale of asset should be added profit on sale of asset should be deducted then out of that income tax paid should be deducted whatever the difference come net operating activity first is how it is closing profit minus opening profit add back depreciation goodwill retail now transfer to reserve provision for taxation proposed dividend loss on sale of asset then in that profit on sale of asset income tax paid should be deducted difference is net operating activities then cash flow from investing activity purchase is outflow sale is inflow sale of fixed asset inflow sale of investment inflow purchase of fixed outflow purchase of investment outflow whatever the difference comes it is called net cash flow from investing activity cash flow from financial activity issue of share may be equity share or preference share issue of debenture then redemption of preference share redemption of debenture so this is the financial aid. net cash flow from financial activity had three activities operating activity investing activity and financial activity had opening cash that should be equal to closing cash we'll move on to problem this is a problem they have given they will give the balance sheet of 2006 to this is 2005 this is 2006 some adjusted depreciation 25% was charged on opening value of mystery building and construction not subject to any depreciation 20000 paid as income tax during the year and old machine costing 20000 returned by 80000 8000 was sold for 14000 so before that we'll give one hint any asset in a asset account if you prepare any asset account here opening value two balance brought down assume that it is 1 lakh by balance carried down 80000 So we started with one lakh. End of the year, twenty thousand. How much has come down? Twenty thousand, which is called depreciation. B by chance, sale. Instead of eighty thousand, it's only seventy thousand. 
then 30,000 is the depreciation by chance. End of the year is 1,20,000. So 1 lakh become 1 lakh. How much more? 20,000. That is purchases. Here, the difference will come 20,000 as purchases. Understand? 1 lakh, end of the year 1 lakh 20,000. How much purchase is 28? Here, first difference is depreciation. Second difference is sale. Important. First difference is depreciation. Second difference comes here, sale. Here, the difference is purchases. You remember. Here, first difference is depreciation. Second difference is sale. Here, difference is purchase. Then, provision for taxation. By balance brought down. To cash tax paid. Assume that your opening balance is 10,000. Tax paid is 6,000. What is the balance? 4,000. Instead of 4,000, you have got 14,000. How much more? 10,000 more. 10,000 is provision for taxation. Opening balance 10,000. How much paid? 6,000. What is the balance? 4,000. Instead of 4,000, I got 14,000. How much difference? 10,000. That is provision for taxation. You have to remember. Uh, now we will go to problem. As for the problem, your plant and which opening value is 2 lakh, 25% depreciation comes to 50,000. Then the return down value of the missionary is 14,000. It has been sold for 8,000. Return down value is 8,000. I will show the problem. Your return down value is 8,000. It has been sold for 14,000. It has been sold for 14,000 at a profit of 6,000. End of the year, you had a balance of 2 lakh 80,000 means how much per cash per balancing figure purchases 1 lakh 38,000 has been purchased. I will repeat 2 lakh division is 50,000, 8,000 has been sold for 14,000 at a profit of 6,000. The ending figure is 2 lakh 80,000. So they purchase how much 1 lakh 38,000. So purchase will come in the investment activity as outflow, sale will come as an inflow. Then building, opening balance 1 lakh 60,000, end is 2 lakh 40,000. How much purchase? 2 lakh 40,000 is purchased. Then provision for taxation by balance brought down 28,000. Income tax paid is 20,000. How much balance should be left over? 8,000. Instead of 8,000, how much is left over? 40,000. So how much more? Actually, at the 40,000. So there is a difference of 32,000. That is provision for taxation created. Provision for taxation created. We move on. Cash flow from financial activity. Profit before taxation. 40 minus 24 is 16,000. See that? 40,000. End beginning 24,000. End 40,000. So there is a difference of 16,000. Add back depreciation 50,000. Proposed dividend as per the problem is 80,000. Provision for taxation working note is 32,000. Transfer to reserve 80 minus 60 is 20,000. It is 1,98,000 minus profit on sale of machine 6,000. It is 1,92,000. So here, after arriving back, this we should see that. Bring out the difference between closing profit and opening. Your closing profit is 40,000. Your opening for 24,000. Increase of 16,000. Add non-cash items. Which are the non-cash items are? Division on machinery, 50,000. Proposed dividend as per the problem is 80,000. Provision for tax as per the working note is 32,000. Transfer is there. So beginning up there 60 and 80,000. There's a difference of 20,000. It becomes... 1,98,000 out of that profit and sale of fishery 6,000 should be deducted. Difference is 1,92,000. Then add decrease in current asset or increase in current liability formula. 
decrease in current aside, increase in current liability, decrease in receivable 2 lakh 80 minus 2 lakh is 80,000 less increase in current aside, decrease in current liability, increase in stock 80,000, decrease in credit are 48,000, difference is 1 lakh 44,000 minus income tax paid 20,000, it becomes 1 lakh 24,000 net operating activity. Then cash flow from investing activity, sale of machinery 14,000, purchase of machinery 1,38,000, purchase is outflow, sale is inflow, purchase of building is 80,000, this is outflow, then purchase of investment is 40,000, it is bracket means 2,44,000 is negative figure, then cash flow from financial equity, share capital, end of year 4 lakh, Beginning of a 3 lakh 20, there is a difference of 80,000. Debenture is showed 80,000. Dividend paid nil. So it is 1 lakh 20,000. If we add all the three activities, A plus B plus C, it comes to here nil. Then add opening balance 80,000. Closing balance also 80,000. So which are the three activities are operating activity, investing activity, financial activity. In operating first, what is the first step to do? Difference in profit, closing profit minus opening profit. Add the non-cash item, which are the non-cash items are depreciation, transfer to reserve, proposed dividend and provision for taxation. Loss on sale of asset should be added. Minus profit on sale of asset should be deducted. What we did the same thing here. Depreciation on machinery, proposed dividend, provision for taxation, transfer to reserve should be added. Minus income profit on sale of machinery should be deducted. Then decrease, add decrease in current asset, increase in current liability. This is decrease in receivable 80,000, increase in stock 1,60,80,000, decrease in credit or 3,20 minus 1,48,000. Cash flow from operating activity is 1,44,000 minus income tax paid is 20, net amount is 1,24,000. Come back to investing activity, sale of plant is 14,000, this is inflow, purchase of machinery outflow, purchase of building outflow, investment is outflow, here, net, here the negative balance is 2,44,000. Cash flow from financial activity, share capital 80,000, debenture 80,000, dividend paid 40, it is 120,000. If you add all these three figures, we get the next figure. Add opening balance of 80,000, the closing balance is also 80,000. So three activities have a definite problem from the, from the point of the examination. So what are the three activities are? Operating activity, investing activity, financial activity. So, operating equity should be made, difference in profit, add non-cash item, depreciation, transfer reserve, proposed dividend, loss on sale of asset, provision for taxation should be add back, minus profit on sale of asset should be deducted. Then add, decrease in current asset, increase in current liability, opposite, that format you have to learn, this format you have to learn, add, decrease in current asset, increase in current liability, less increase in current asset, decrease in current liability. This you have to learn here, non-cash item. Once it comes here, add, decrease in current asset and increase in current liability, they should be added. Less opposite, increase in current, current asset, decrease in current liability. This should be learned here. Once you learn here, three activities are operating, first one, operating activity, investing activity and the financial activity. All the problems will be easy. So, in the next session, we'll solve some more problem on cash flow statement. Hope you understand. We'll meet in the next ses session with another problem. In then, goodbye. Meet in the next session.